at 624, we continue our series of reports on women making a difference as we spotlight the accomplishments of Michelle Buck from humble beginnings to running a Fortune 500 company. Buck's climbed her way up the corporate ladder. Alicia Richards has her story. The CEO of the Hershey Company doesn't just work here, she grew up here in Carlisle. Growing up there, I never envisioned that I would be the CEO of a Fortune 500 company. I grew up from very humble means. My mom grew up on a farm with no indoor plumbing. My father was the first in his family to graduate from high school. 57-year-old Michelle Buck is the first female CEO of the Hershey Company. Only 5% of Fortune 500 CEOs are female. Her success is being noticed by women. But in the manufacturing facilities in particular, women have contacted me, sent me all kinds of letters, and what they say is they can now see themselves in the leadership of this company. She says more women will become CEOs when they stop being too hard on themselves for not being perfect. I think women need to start by having confidence in, them, in themselves. I don't think women always believe that they can achieve um, the ultimate in greatness, and I think it starts with knowing yourself, knowing what you're good at, and then allowing yourselves to go for that opportunity. Earlier in her career, she was asked to be in charge of a struggling plant for another company. She wasn't sure she could do it. She did it anyway and excelled. Earlier jobs in the mid-state shaped her career too. First it was a paper route, I babysat, I waitressed, I sold Avon door to door, I was a bank teller, I worked in retail. Here she is at Hershey Park at the age of 10. After Carlisle High School, she went to Hack, graduated from Shippensburg University, and worked for the state at the Department of Revenue. She couldn't have imagined the day she would be offered this job. What did that feel like? I gotta say it felt pretty good. <laughs> Being a rare female CEO for two years now has its unique experiences. I frequently go to conferences where I am one of the few. I never feel like I'm treated differently by virtue of being a woman. I think people accept me as being the CEO of the Hershey Company. And yet, you notice it when you walk in the room and it feels a little bit different. Chatting in her office after our interview, I couldn't help but ask for a selfie and ask about her family. Are your kids impressed by you? They probably are, although I don't know if they're that much more impressed than any other kids are with their parents. Yeah. <laughs> Alicia Richards, Jet 24 Action News. Celebrating Women brought to you by Brazeri Deary, Village West in Erie.